We are only one day away from the AutoZone Liberty Bowl in Memphis. Thousands of Cyclone fans have made their way down for a full day of pep rallies, a parade, and fun on Beale Street. That's where we find Local 5's Jake Brand with more on ISU's path to Memphis. Cyclone fans have made it to Beale Street, which is something that most thought was very unrealistic back in September. It started with the gambling investigation this summer. Four starters gone for the season and then rock bottom. One and two start, including a 10 to seven loss at Ohio. But sure enough, Iowa State found a way with one of the youngest teams in the country going six and three in Big 12 play, finding themselves in a bowl game. Throughout the season, the team just improved. Week by week, Rocco Beck in the offense got better into November. The turnaround started losing to that max score. It really made us who we are today because without our, that Ohio loss, we wouldn't have felt like that and we wouldn't have worked hard, as hard as we, uh, as we should have been working already. That's the thing that's been fun about this team is every week of the football season we've gotten better. And I don't know if, you know, at least during my time here, that that's ever truly happened. But this group, this has happened. And, uh, you know, again, we got one more great opportunity, hopefully, to grow forward tomorrow. But uh, this group's done a great job of growing. That's probably what's given me so much belief in them. Campbell also said that back in June, he knew this team would figure it out, but he didn't know how. One of the reasons was the emergence of redshirt freshman QB Rocco Becht. Many Cyclone fans know that Rocco is the son of Anthony Becht, a former NFL tight end and the current head coach of the St. Louis Battlehawks in the XFL. We had the chance to talk about his son's progression with Anthony. He's moving along a much more quicker pace than I was, but uh, I'm just proud of him. He's put the work in. It's his journey, and uh, he's got a great team. Uh, you know, he's got great people around him, and that's what counts. That's what helps everything kind of push forward. And I'm just sitting back and enjoying the ride like everybody else. Rocco certainly has a good mentor to learn from, and he'll be an X Factor tomorrow. The Cyclone offense will need to have a big day. And later in the show, Raina Garcia caught up with our sister station in Memphis to learn about the Tigers' X's and O's. But for now, from Beale Street, Jake Brand, Local 5 Sports.